A second vaccine has shown to be effective in major trials in just 24 hours. The latest is the Janssen vaccine. It's 66% effective overall and only needs a single dose. And crucially, it is 85% effective against severe disease. Last night, Novavax announced UK trials had shown its vaccine to be 89% effective. And crucially, that vaccine protects against the new, more contagious UK variant. If approved, the UK has millions of doses of both vaccines on order, though they wouldn't be available until later in the year. Our medical editor, Fergus Walsh, reports. COVID vaccine trials keep delivering results beyond all expectations. These volunteers in Southampton are among tens of thousands worldwide testing the vaccine from Janssen, part of the pharmaceutical giant Johnson & Johnson, which will produce one billion doses of its jab this year. We have a single shot vaccine which can protect very highly 85% against severe disease and complete protection against death and hospitalization after day 28. And that's a finding which was across the world in all the regions, um, independent of age and independent of strain. The results from the US biotech Novavax are nothing short of spectacular. This site in London, part of a UK-wide trial, which showed the vaccine offered strong protection even against the contagious new variant first identified in Kent. It's very significant uh, because we were able to show that the vaccine works well against both the old, the original strain and the new strain. It had 96% efficacy against the original COVID-19 strain, and yet it still had 86% efficacy against the variant strain. So how do they work? The Novavax jab uses proteins from the surface spike of coronavirus and combine these with a chemical booster or adjuvant. The Janssen vaccine puts the gene for the spike protein into a harmless virus, a similar approach to the Oxford AstraZeneca jab. Both vaccines prime the immune system, including creating antibodies which will target coronavirus in the event of infection. The Novavax jab will be manufactured on Teesside, part of a deal struck last year to ensure a steady flow of vaccine. The UK has ordered 100 million doses of the Oxford AstraZeneca vaccine and 40 million of Pfizer's. Both of these are in limited supply at the moment. The 17 million doses of Moderna's vaccine won't arrive until the spring. Then there's the two vaccines which have just yielded results. 60 million doses of the Novavax jab, they'll take a few months to be delivered. Plus, 30 million of the single dose Janssen vaccine. Now, if those last two are approved, that'll be enough doses to immunise the entire UK population twice over. Later this year, the UK is likely to have such a surplus of COVID vaccine, it may be giving it away. But for the next few months, supply will be tight. Two more vaccines to add to the toolbox. This gives more resilience and more tools, new tools that were different from the last ones. Uh, it means that we can spread the vaccine around. It means that we can really start to impact on this pandemic, not just here, but right the way across the world. Are you ready? Yeah. Vaccinating one country in a pandemic is like putting a sticking plaster on a gaping wound. Until the whole world is protected, none of us truly will be. Fergus Walsh, BBC News.